So we got a 9320 today. The customer said the steering cylinder's leaking. So we're gonna re-kit the cylinder. He looks like he started to take the cylinder off because he took the front pin out. But I'm gonna take, go ahead and take the back pin out. I was just like swinging them around and leaving the front pin in and taking it all apart on the tractor. I'll stick that pin back in there then. So on this style of cylinder, it's got the, the four notches there. It's, there's technically a special tool you can use to take it off of there, but I like to use an air hammer and uh, just slowly uh, and easily just vibrate it off. They usually come off pretty easy. And then you can just, once you get it broke free, it'll just usually spin right off of there. After you get the nut off, you have to, on this cylinder style, you have to drive in the guide and then there's a snap ring inside there and you'll pop the snap ring out and the whole thing will pull out of there then. So I like to drive them in with a brass drift so we don't damage too much. And then right there you can see the snap ring. So we'll get the snap ring popped out. So I got it pulled out. Now we'll disassemble it, put new seals in it. We're gonna take the nut off so we can get the piston off using the Milwaukee three quarter. Pull the piston off. Pull the guide. We're gonna change all the seals out on everything. Always wanna make sure and inspect the shaft. Because sometimes they'll have defects, chrome flaking or something that'll cause the seals to go out. This one looks pretty good. So we're gonna clean all the rust out of here too before we put our new seals in. If there's any kind of rust buildup, seal won't want to seal very good. We got the steering cylinder fixed and also i fixed a couple leaking scvs on this thing so this customer's ready to go back to the field to work some ground <laughs> 